Welcome to the Thunder Post Game Show. John Rohde alongside Thunder beat writer Darnell Mayberry. Thunder loses game two, 196, down 17 early, real early. Came back, not quite enough time, not quite enough points. Darnell, your thoughts? Just a slow start. It doomed the Thunder, and they got to figure out a way to start better because these slow starts are, are hurting them. And on the biggest stage, you got to do better than that. You can't come out and trail 18 to 2 uh, in the first period and get behind 17 in the first half on two occasions. Uh, something's got to give with the offense. They got to find a way to get better shots, uh, get more high percentage shots, and, and have some more efficiency offensively. All right, one for 11. That, that explains the slow start, Darnell. But what brought them back, and why so late? Well, I think, you know, James Harden really got going. He he really picked up. You got to give credit to James Harden after scoring five points in the in game one. He came out and had 21 off the bench tonight, and I think he was really more aggressive and, and really gave this team a spark. But, you know, they need more help. Uh, Russell Westbrook started 0 for 6, and he struggled with his shot throughout the night. Kevin Durant really, uh, he ended up with 32 points and a pretty good night, but that took, you know, 16 fourth quarter points. So these guys have got to play for 48 minutes. When they do that, we've seen that they're, uh, as about as unbeatable as you can be in this league. For the first time in the playoffs, Eric Spolstra, the Heat coach, went with the starting lineup of James, Wade, Bosch, Battier, and Chalmers. Every one of them played at least 39 minutes and uh, got off to a great start. Why change from here on out? I don't think he will. I think he, he knew that Chris Bosch was ready for this moment. He came out and got a double-double. He was aggressive early, uh, especially defensive rebounding. He, he really helped the team uh, control the, the boards tonight. Uh, and I think that was big for the, for the Heat. Um, you know, I just don't think that there was any way that the Heat could come back and, and play seven guys again like they did essentially in game one. And they did it again tonight. I just think the difference was Chris Bosch. All right, so game three is Sunday night in Miami. Darnell, you said this might be a good thing for the Thunder to lose this game, then go to Miami. Why? Because if they won this game, I think maybe they got fat and happy and went to Miami thinking that they were just simply better than the Heat. And that could have possibly led to a blowout in game three. But now they know after two slow starts, after losing home court advantage, they got to go to Miami and really give it their all and, and play the best 48-minute game that they can possibly play, play. And I think if they do that, they're going to be able to come out of uh, Miami with a win in game three, whereas before, uh, maybe they weren't, weren't going to be able to do that. All right, so Darnell has taken his talents to South Beach. <laughs> we'll, we'll join you there. For the best Thunder coverage anywhere, keep it right here on NewsOK.com and every day in the Oklahoman. Thank you.